Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. I'm Monica, if this is your first time here. And today I'm gonna show you how I create one of my most favorite DIY vases. For this project, you'll need a vase, a hot glue gun, and a can of spray paint in whatever color you would like. I picked up this vase from Hobby Lobby. I really love the shape of it. And it was $7.99. Actually, it was 50% off the week that I got it, so I paid less than $7.99. Earlier when I was mentioning the products that you would need, I said a hot glue gun, but I forgot to mention that you're going to need glue sticks for this project. Most of the time when you have to use a hot glue gun, you're going to need the hot glue gun sticks. <laughs> so before you do anything else, the first thing you'll need to do is plug this bad boy up, get it nice and hot. And then once you do that, you can begin to do what it is that you see me doing right now, and that is put horizontal streaks on all the sides but you want to do one side at a time and what's nice about this project is that the glue streaks they don't take a long time to dry with that being said it won't take you very long to complete this project I got to this side I noticed I liked the staggered look a bit more so when I began making my glue streaks on this side I made them long and then underneath it I will make a shorter line and then underneath that one I will put maybe two short ones next to each other I kind of switched up the pattern every other row a bit but of course you could do yours however you like and it will still look bomb I do want to mention that you can complete this project using other adhesives. Whatever you decide to use is your choice. I prefer hot glue because it dries fast and you won't have to wait a day or two for it to dry completely like you would with other adhesives. But I understand other creatives, you know, they might not have hot glue on hand or they prefer something like E6000 or what have you. You can use whatever you like, um, but I just use hot glue because I felt like it was the easier option and I like the look of it better. As you can see I am now done putting the glue streaks on each side of the vase and now I'm just looking it over checking to make sure I like it and I did notice that there was like a big streak of glue on one side so I went ahead and took that off and then redid that part but other than that it was absolutely perfect once that's all done drying then I'm gonna proceed to the next step which is spray painting the vase so for spray paint, I chose to use Rust-Oleum's Flat Black Paint. I chose black because black is so dope to me. It's one of my favorite colors and it goes with the theme of my home decor. I chose flat over glossy spray paint because I love the look of the matte finish. Once you finish spray painting it, all you have left to do is let it dry and then you're done. Easy, huh? Yep, I know. And here is the finished look. I think it looks amazing. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you so much for being here. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see more from me. Follow me on Instagram at the Monica McGee, and I will see you guys in the next video. Later.